sun, moon, and stars into it. Greetings, suns and moons, and of course I have to welcome back all my stars. If you're new to the channel, welcome to the Mothership. I do appreciate the likes, the donations, the shares, the confirmations you send me through email. The positive energy you show me, the positive energy you show yourself, and overall the positive way you show up in the planet. Now with that being said, let's get in there like a swimwear. Ho oh, uh, ho! I don't know why I got the four horsemen's. I believe the, the, the horsemen's... Uh, our horses are black. And then I heard we ride in at dawn. Interesting enough, there's two horse. Look, is that a unicorn there? Okay. This could be a future event. All right. This is about taking action. Somebody moving forward passionately. Somebody's got a spark here. Uh, I feel like there's some truth coming. And then before I turned on the camera, I picked up the energy of Celtic. Now, if somebody has Celtic background, I'm hearing origin, origins. Maybe a Celtic name, maybe even a Celtic cross. Take it how it resonates, okay? We're talking about reciprocity, the six of coins, equal give and take, fair exchange, no robbery, you use me, I use you, right? That's all we think. This is about an offer. This is also about you using your intuition. Somebody's very sensitive at this time, okay? I feel like something is being awakened in you or in someone else, possibly after going within. Let's see. <sighs> All right. Whatever this was, whatever battle this was, obviously it took strength. Okay, maybe somebody needs to regain their strength. Somebody's coming in with the truth here. Somebody could be confronting someone that was involved in some sort of debauchery here. Okay, somebody could also be pain. Right, if you hear me hopping and puffing, I hit them stairs, but we're going to go ahead and keep on moving. A channel coming up the stairs, nothing comes for free. Be mindful of someone coming in and offering you something free. We got the strength card here. We're talking about patience to persevere. Uh, obviously, this is surrounding an ending. Okay, I'm also hearing a renewal of something. Some of you, you may be having to renew you know, maybe your vehicle registration or some sort of certificate or something like that uh, is is uh, pertinent in this situation. I'm also hearing decision. OK, somebody could. Ooh. All right. So maybe you're traveling to have some surgery done or maybe somebody's healing from some form of heartbreak. Let's see what's up under there. Oh, yeah. We're talking about. Um, financial lack, lack consciousness, somebody feeling. Uh, left out of a situation, somebody feeling disgraced, dishonored, not feeling protected with the five of pentacles. This has something to do with money. So somebody contributes their um, importance to their finances here. This is somebody that's very self-absorbed. This is also someone that's involved in some sort of thievery, some sort of betrayal here. Okay. This could also be an affair and somebody getting left. Okay. Now, since I then touched on this already and we ain't even started to read if you are experiencing any mental physical financial depression health issues seek out the proper authorities this reading is for <laughs> entertainment purposes only okay now you know i gotta remind people is somebody have a memory loss or is this selective memory Now, you know, I got to remind people and warn people. I got a doppelganger, a copycat, a replica, a clone. I want to be me, but try and do it better than me. An English professor, a WhatsApp bandit, and a voodoo high priest. Our priestess all floating through that comment section, but also got a lot of love. That voodoo high priest is promising to get your love back for a small fee of $39.99. Ooh, all you got to do is sign your life away on the dotted line. Do not fall for the okie doke people. If you have to bend someone's will for them to be with you or for you to be with them, they don't need you and you definitely don't need them. This is past, present, or future energies. Parts may resonate with you, parts may not. Take what's for you and leave the rest. This could be someone in your environment, someone thinking of you, you're thinking of them, my ex, a coworker, passed over loved one. You may or may not know these individuals. Any and all information that you need about me or regarding this reading shall be in the description box below, including the link where you can copy and paste that in your browser and receive a free 
birth chart from a reputable site. No affiliation to me. Be mindful the scammers are scamming. I will not solicit you for my services. All right. I will not ask for donations. All right. All my personal sessions are closed. I want to welcome back all my loyal viewers, subscribers, my members. I appreciate all of you. Thank you for the prayers. Thank you for the shares. Thank you for the donations. All right. Now, with that being said, let's get in there like a swimwear. Oh, we got six of wands. Okay. I'm hearing destruction. Uh, specifically, uh, somebody's coming back here. Okay. Somebody may have came back from some sort of struggle, bondage. Somebody didn't expect someone to overcome some adversity here. This is surrounded something that was offered. This, this could be something you offered something to uh, you offered to someone or somebody offered something to you. We're talking about the beginning here. We're talking about the effects of trying to manipulate some energy, the effects of, of collaboration. All right. To show me. Uh -huh. Having to do with and are in regards to this Queen of Pentacles energy. Okay. Some of you, you had to disassociate yourself or stop funding something. You may have had to move away from a project temporarily or whoever this is. Somebody may have tried to run off on the plug twice. Did you find out that somebody was uh, uh, stealing from the church's, church's fund, the funding or something? I don't know what's going on. Somebody taking from the fan. The fan. Whoa. Somebody taking from the hand that feeds them. Oh, sucky, sucky. We're talking about some sort of fortune here. Something is etched in stone. I feel like this, I want to say this is like Greek or Celtic or something like that. Somebody's into mythology here, like strong mythology. Something was prophesized here. Okay. Uh, I feel like... Somebody was trying to manifest. <laughs> somebody was trying to manifest some deceitful destruction, and it showed up in their own environment. Uh, either you or whoever this is could be experiencing some form of natural disaster. It was after trying to send something here, maybe give an offering to make some sort of chaos. Okay. Uh, yeah. You see this? It's like stuff all over. And betrayal and the Knight of Wands. <laughs> so somebody thought you was weak. They thought you they thought you was weak here. Yeah. Somebody is greedy. This they didn't did this more than once. Okay. In the past, this may have worked, but it ended up coming right back. This happened in, in the past, okay. Recent past for somebody. All right. I feel like somebody, you know, we've been getting that energy of return to sender. Something was blocked off or returned immediately and it caused some sort. I'm like, let me move on. Um, here we go. Already. It flipped upside down. The Queen of Cups in reverse. We're talking about Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. Very low vibrational energy. You don't have to be um, a Cancer, Pisces or Scorpio to be in this energy. This is someone that offered something. Someone for exchange of something, possibly stardom, possibly fame. But they was doing this to a star seed elect, one of chosen one, a throne, someone that has a high, a high calling on their life. OK. Um, for some of you, somebody was trying to manifest somebody coming to you, whoever this Knight of Cups is, or you were trying to manifest somebody going to my collective here. Somebody has hmm, somebody has a. Uh, some sort of obsession or addiction to this person in this star energy. This is surrounding somebody's work. Okay, and star quality. Somebody could be rising to stardom. We got that Bonnie and Clyde energy. <laughs> oh, why is the star card here? Either show me what it is I need to see. Come on, man. So this is surrounding an emperor... And this high priestess, something that was prophesized by a high priestess, or this could be somebody's divine counterpart and or this is you. Something was hidden here about this star. Somebody might be trying to keep something hidden. Maybe they may be hiding 
They may be hiding. Knight of Cups, why is this here? Somebody's trying to keep what they are manifesting with you a secret. For some of you, this is your divine counterpart, okay? That you are either trying to keep something secret or hidden. Because we got the moon and the sun. We got the moon and the stars. I don't see the sun yet. Oh, yes, we do. No. Not yet. Leo energy. Why is uh, the Knight of Cups here? <laughs> you probably saying, why, why are you laughing, Ethan? Because that's the chariot. So that's the throne. This chariot is going straight into the strength energy. That's the sun. We did see the sun earlier. Okay, so this is my collective somebody was going up against. I could tell somebody's apologetic. See this line here? Somebody's on the cusp or, or somebody line. Somebody's on the cusp of Cancer and Leo. Or you could be a Cancer or a Leo. This is significant here. You conquered something. Okay. Um, somebody that was a little bit jaded. Well, a lot of bit jaded. This person is insecure. Okay. They're, they're, they give offerings here. Okay, somebody could have went to a high priestess and had something, um, I'm hearing interpreted, but I'm also hearing internalize the moon, the moon. Okay, I feel like your divine masculine or masculine, take it how it resonates, or masculine, you are watching your person. Something was offered by this Queen of Cups energy in reverse. This is somebody that's insecure. This is somebody that was codependent. They were scared to um, lose their position here with this emperor. They feel defeated. This is also someone that is emotionally manipulative here. They pull on your heartstrings. You may want to come in and apologize. Or somebody wants to come in and apologize to you. They realize something here. Um, somebody could be a star gazer, a star seeds, or the stars is significant. This could be taking place by... Um, the next full moon or following or, you know, a full moon that's coming up. There may be a lot of I'm hearing seismic activity. I don't know. Um, I just noticed there's a sun right here. Um, there may be a lot of shooting stars or somebody seen a shooting star and something was confirmation. Maybe this will be confirmation here. Somebody may spend a lot of time on the water or somebody's not touching the surf. Like they're, they're only touching the surface of their emotions. This is someone that may not want to face the truth. It's going to take somebody courage to come towards you. Um, this is surrounded some sort of deception here. Somebody having their boundaries up. This deception could have took place during a full moon, a new moon. Uh, I'm hearing a crescent moon or what they call a mid cycle or something like that. But somebody's defenses is up with this uh, nine of wands here. Strong defenses. Okay. Somebody did something way too much. This was their wish fulfillment. Okay. What they invested in. It's Queen of Wands. Oh, look at all. They look like snakes or something. Vines. A vineyard could be significant. Somebody came in and told some sort of truth really quickly or a truth was spoken about this person. Like, I'm, I'm getting like this was something real quick by somebody unexpected too. Six of Wands. Why is this here? This person... <laughs> This person is self, I mean, I'm here to know it all. Somebody feels like they know it all. Um, this could be a mother figure of yours or someone. Or people may see this person as nurturing. Somebody gave an offer to someone. Okay. I feel like this was a reading. Yeah. There was some sort of temptation surrounding some information. Okay, somebody pulls from low vibrational energies, entities, somebody's easily tested, somebody gives offerings to um, very low vibing energies. Okay, or they take offers from very low vibing energies with the Knight of Wands to the Queen of Wands. Okay, so somebody felt like they gained a victory, but they didn't see all this smoke. It was illusion here. Whoever they paid. Or whoever paid this person. They were definitely working together here. Now they're in this energy of having to hold back. 
Penny pinch is what I'm getting here. Okay. Somebody has a fear of change. They may fear the change that you went through. Somebody may have tried to say that you were kicked out of heaven or uh, casted out of heaven. Maybe they attempted to do this. It was like a unanimous vote. Here we go with that uh, power of three stuff here. This was a, a unanimous vote. So this person attempted to play judge and jury. This is something that is hidden. They don't want people to know that they uh, partake in this because people give give this individual money. Three of Pentacles. They have an outside exterior as loving and caring. This person may cry uh, to gain sympathy as well. Three of Pentacles. Why is this here? Heartbreak. Heartbreak. That's what I'm getting. I don't. It, they go to strength. Heartbreak. I know that three of swords um, indicates heartbreak. Okay, but when I touch that lovers card, that's what I. That's what I got. Is this lovers or is this the emperor? It's the emperor. You can show me what it is I need to see. Seven of Wands. So, okay. For some of you, this could be like a false flame. This could be somebody that you have a child with. Okay. This could be a distorted masculine. You may not know this person. This could be a friend of a true emperor. Yeah, because we got the emperor twice right there. Right there. Okay. So somebody felt like they got away with something. For some of you, this is somebody that you have a child with. Or this person has a child with. And what do you know? They're going to lover's card. Somebody felt like they defeated someone and they were working together with the spouse or somebody that's on their vibration. Okay. Oh, man. Somebody's trying to hide, hide someone, possibly even shadow them. Okay. That's what I'm getting. And some sort of truth was spoken that put somebody in defense here. We got the seven of wands in reverse. So we're talking about somebody overstepping their boundaries here. Something that they they attempted to collaborate against someone. They 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 plans fell apart here. This is something that's currently happening. Four of Pentacles. Somebody underestimated underestimated someone's strength. They see you as um, somebody who feels like they're smarter than you. That's what I feel. But it's like they underestimate your strength, maybe because you're somebody mm, you may have had like a romance with this person. This person may have always underestimated your, your strength here. Something was hidden from you um, or hidden from this person. Four of Pentacles. Why is this here? You can show me what it is I need to see. You definitely, you know, you're protected here um, in all different directions, north, south, east, west. Somebody deals with the elements, water, fire, earth, uh, air. OK, um, there's a connection here with the hermit card being here. Somebody wanted you to hold back. Or they wanted people to hold back from you and you develop some sort of strength here, some sort of intuitive gift. OK. Or you're going to. This is about a belief could be a marriage as well. And they're going to three of swords. They're going to three of swords. <laughs> Whoever, if this is like a married couple. Maybe this is your false flame or somebody, your ex-husband or somebody that you have a child with. They are gaslighting someone or triangulating you. Um, like they want this person to be in competition with you for some reason. Why is the world of fortune here? 
You can show me what it is I need to see. <laughs> the magician. So we're talking about fate. Um, and what's this in reverse? We got the magician in reverse here. We got the magician in reverse there. So we're definitely speaking about energy being returned. Okay. And it was a faded situation because somebody had an empty victory. They thought they won. They were being praised by the people um, in their environment, people that applaud this person for their evil deeds here. This could be like a, a group or a collaboration. Y'all know the other words here. Somebody was somebody was somebody was taking money um, by Someone that is emotionally manipulative. This is also someone that will gaslight you or gaslight whoever this is to get them to do their evil biddings. This is somebody, this could be your emperor, okay? Your masculine or masculine. This is somebody that you are in a soul contract with, a very low level uh, soulmate. Now, this person, you may have a child with them or they're trying to manifest a child using spells. OK, um, for some of you, this person may have even offered you a throttle. OK, or some sort of alternative lifestyle. There's definitely someone that is with child here in this situation. Something was also prophesied by a child. I believe someone tried to chat someone with a child. And that has been revealed or is going to be revealed. OK, it's something about this star. I want to say uh, 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 there there was some sort of conception here. Or maybe somebody seen a star. Maybe you was out on the boat or something like that. Let's see. Three of cups. Come on, man. Magician in reverse. Why is this here? Somebody can't think straight. They don't know whether to move forward. Or to come towards someone that they betrayed is also what I'm picking up. This person feels punished by a collaboration. They definitely are. This person is not able to manifest. Magician in reverse. Why is this here? Somebody wastes a lot of energy, money, time just to get defeated. Somebody, Somebody's moving away anyway or somebody has to move. Yeah, they got, they got smited. Is that a word? They got smited here. Action was stopped. Okay. Somebody's spouse attempted to do something here. This was most definitely their wish fulfillment, but they can't manifest. They're wasting a lot of energy. Somebody feels, hmm, because somebody's in their North Node with the Ten of Cups here. Of course, they didn't want you to be able to manifest, right? We got the Wicker Man. <laughs> I mean, it's not funny, y'all, but this is somebody that felt like they were working against you and they were working with other people, but, but these other people was using this person. Ain't that something? If somebody wants to be a throne, they want to be a queen of pentacles. I feel like this emperor may end up isolating themselves. Okay, I'm hearing frugal. Somebody's being humbled in this situation. Uh, somebody needs to go within is also what I'm picking up. Okay. Maybe you went within. You may be thinking about an offer or somebody. It's like somebody's trying to manifest you think about them. But there's an action that is stopped here with the Ten of Wands um, in the Hermit in the Strength card. Something was stopped. This person feels exhausted. So they're, ha they're, having, they're having to stop something. The page is significant. It's, it, this could be some somebody that you have children with. This could be happening to your children. But it's like somebody's developing their intuition or they're starting to. And there go the Knight of Cups. It's like, it's like they're second guessing themselves. It's not funny, but it is funny. Let me tell you why. Because this person was deceptive. They worked with other people 
to attempt to block whoever this is. And they didn't realize the other people that they were working with. This is this is all last week's energy. Let me move on because, you know, I feel like, you know, you know, they say when, you, when you, you're hitting an unalive horse in the head. Yeah, and and of course, I know these people watch me. That's why the, that's why the energy comes up like that. They do whatever it is they do, and then they watch to see if it's take. Stop, because if you're doing it to me, I'm sending all every last bit of it back. Okay, just to let you know. Why is I keep looking at this Nine of Wands? Um, either show me what it is I need to see. So we got somebody that's very passionate working with somebody that was passionate about you. <laughs> ah, you know, that old sticks and stones may hurt my bones, but names will never hurt me. Somebody was trying to create a false rea reality or a false narrative surrounding somebody's structure. You could be seeing 22 or 30. That could be significant. Okay. But I feel like either this is someone that wants to be somebody's divine uh, person or they just want a title, okay? Somebody wants to feel like they like they're better than someone. Knight of Wands, but they're. I mean, <laughs> let me let me stop. Knight of Wands, let me stop. <sighs> Somebody feels like they're a master at something. They're not. They're not sincere though. Um, they got an ego complex. That's what it is. You may have had to detach yourself. Okay, or you did, and that may have sent this person um, into a downward spiral. It's, it's something about a vision, somebody's vision. Knight of Wands, why is this here? Maybe they're trying to block your, your vision. There go that selective memory here. Shadow, working in the shadow. No doubt, whoever, whoever is in this energy, you were seeing signs. Everybody was seeing signs, but I feel like the ego... Their ego may have blocked them from their intuition or from what source was trying to relate to them. And there go that unicorn. Somebody could be an Aquarius. Okay, let's see. We got the high priestess. That's Pisces and Cancer for me. All right. We got Scorpio here as well. We got uh, the Emperor. Could be an Aries. Could be a Taurus. And I'm, I'm I'm also guided to add um, Capricorn in there. Um, so some of y'all, that's not the that card. Okay, well the way I read sun, moon, and rise, uh, sun, moon, and stars, intuitive. I don't just pick up on the meaning of the cards. I pick up on the exaltation. Okay, I pick up on um, the actual sun signs that belong to the planets so my the way i read is totally different okay there are the star card aquarius the moon could be somebody's moon sign as well all right uh cancer again with the chariot the hermit virgo could be a Gemini, uh, yeah, Gemini involved in this as well, and a Sagittarius, and of course you could be a Cusper. Somebody was doing things in the shadow. Forty-four. We're talking about partnerships, okay? Working together. I don't know how har harmonious this partnership is. Somebody definitely needed to get structured, okay? Somebody could be running off on a bill as well. Or maybe somebody took something from work. Why is this three of pentacles here? Maybe they tried to... Hmm, patterns. Okay. These people were all on the same frequency. That's how they ended up uh, working together. Three of pentacles. Maybe they don't know each other. They're just all in the same energy. Because there's... Um, it's, it's, to me, it's, it's about vibe. Like vibration here. Three of Pentacles. Why is this here? Three of coins. Come on, man. So for some of you, this is something that happened in the past. <laughs> Trees in reverse. Somebody needs to get grounded or somebody's being kicked out of the family legacy. Okay. Um, 
So I feel like whoever this is that went into hermit mode or solitude, maybe it's somebody part of this throuple here. They ascended. Okay. They may be trying to atone for their mistakes or their transgressions here. Oh, it's so hard to tell who this is. Maybe they'll come out. Four of Pentacles. Why is this here? You can show me what it is I need to see. And sticks and stones may broke, break my bones, but names will never hurt me. I'm hearing precision. There was some sort of illusion surrounding why somebody held back. Somebody had a fear of change, but something was released here. Hmm. Maybe somebody started having some health issues. Okay. If, if whatever they were doing is backfiring and they wanted you to feel drained or distorted, stomach issues, somebody could be having stomach issues. What is this person? Oh, oh, they're opening up their eye. They're using their intuition, trusting their gut. That's what I'm getting. So somebody that was a part of this sorcery has ascended. But we got trees in reverse. So something was revealed. Something was up, like lifted out the ground is also what I'm getting. Ooh, I heard exhumed. Let's let's move right on along. Um, Ten of Wands, why is this here? Somebody's having to move away from some sort of destructive pattern. Yeah. So whoever this is that was trying to block you from getting the new beginning. I'm hearing they're, they're trusting their intuition. Page of Swords. So somebody's coming through and speaking some sort of truth. Yeah. It's because they it's like it's undeniable. Some pfft. come on, man. It's undeniable. They're seeing too many signs. All right, let, let's see. I'm not taking this one behind the scenes. Um this is Why is this star card here? Either show me what it is. I'm trying to figure out if this is someone that wanted stardom and fame. And maybe that's why they collaborated with the high priestess. To do something in the shadow. Somebody wants to come in. And charm someone, but they may be having to heal. It's like somebody's trying to raise their vibration. Somebody could be doing a detox or some sort of cleansing to like lift their vibration. Somebody's vegan in this situation. Okay, let me tell you what I'm picking up. The vegan, the veganism gave them that extra oomph to be able to manifest, but now that's not working. Like it's not about it's not about only what you're putting into your body. It's about your actual frequency. And somebody's starting to realize that. This is why they feel drained. Um, like somebody's really pale or something. I, is somebody anemic? Or they have low iron or something like that. Star card, why is this here? Ethan, show me what it is I need to see. Looking closely. So somebody's looking closely. Somebody's spouse is looking closely. Oh, yeah. And they see that you're compatible. They're starting to put together healthy. Somebody was willing to do anything for fame. Okay. Um, they didn't want something to change. They didn't want somebody to go through this rebirth, something that was prophesied by a high priestess. I'm also hearing the prophet. OK, could be a high priest involved in this as well. Maybe that is you DM or your DM. 
uh, or um, yeah, or your DM. What am I looking for? I am. I want to see. Why is this? Where is it? The moon card. You can show me what it is I need to see. Oh, yeah. I mean, you can say whatever you want to say when you're pulling cards. But if you heard me, if your first time ever saying either show me what it is I need to see came from me, I don't advise you use that. Now, if it's something that you've been saying before me, then all means, because, you know, my guys is on it, baby. Either show me what it is I need to see. Expect powerful change. New moon eclipse. <laughs> Just start bring love into the situation. New moon in Aquarius. Somebody got a moon in Aquarius. This is about growth. I feel like somebody jumps from spiritual practice to spiritual practice. It's like whatever goes, whatever they feel is going to work. Okay. Somebody, they, they and this person has like, <laughs> this person has... I mean, it could be a reader, but they it's like they think that everything um, like every notion that they get is coming from a higher power. Like it's the higher it's a higher. Well, I wouldn't say higher power. They feel like. Um, everything that is whispered into their ear, like a temptation, like they, they but they don't realize that they're scattered here because of the way they were manifesting or possibly something that they were doing in secret. That's what I'm getting. Because this person is not in touch with their emotions. It's like they need to do shadow work. Um, and because they need to do shadow work, it's like these low, lower vibrational energies tempt this person all the time. I'm here and cleanse their energy. North Node. Step out of your comfort zone. Okay. So the moon represents the subconscious here. So either somebody tapped into that feminine energy and started trying to heal it, trusting their intuition, maybe about a family member, release that family member, and they move forward. Or somebody's expecting you to be emotional about something. Adjustments are acquired. They're going to have quarter moon. So no doubt they're going to. Somebody's going to try and reinforce what they did on the new moon. The end of a tough cycle approaches. Full moon and Capricorn. A new, a new moon. A new start is coming. New moon. Okay, so yeah, they were trying to delay. You know, it's always a delay here. Look at the bigger picture, full moon and Sagittarius. So it's always a delay. So somebody feels they're they're being got they're being misled because they're paying close attention to someone else's business first and foremost. But not only that, what they it, how do I put this? What they think they're doing in secret, they feel like they're getting confirmations by watching whoever this is i mean everything happens for a reason divine timing came out with the high priestess in this last reading that i did here let's see what comes out i keep every time i look at this body and clyde card i get on the run like i don't know like somebody's trying to run from the scene of a crime. Somebody's trying to run from the scene. Are they having to? They're having to, having to give up some work. Somebody could be releasing a family member or a family business is significant. Surrender. Come on. Why is this high priestess here? Ethan, show me what it is I need to see. Come on now. Yeah, you, you, you got to be kidding me. Come on now. 
Come here and get, 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 give it all you got. Give it all you got. You know, that's, oh my goodness. Come on now. Now look, when I first got this, this is a new deck, right? I like it. I like it. Um, the, when I first seen this card, Mystery, I got, what is that? Um, Jack, Jack Pumpkin Seed or Pumpkin Eater, right? <laughs> Obviously, um, we're talking about harvest season. We're talking about the autumn, okay? This could have something to do with the day of the unalive, Halloween time as well. Um, Thanksgiving, right? But somebody has health issues. Let me just put it that way. Somebody has health issues. They may be hiding that they have health issues. They may also be trying to clear up this issue by petitioning. But th here's the thing. How are you trying to get healthy, but you're attract uh, attracted or attached to someone that is draining you? That's the reason why you sit. With signs and synchronicities. Somebody could have a BMW. Faded meat in reverse. Come on, man. So it's like somebody does not want to let go. Maybe that's why this tree is in. They ref they keep trying to save the these people. Now they ain't regret. Somebody's sick. Somebody's sick. They're keeping their feelings, or you're keeping your feelings for this high priestess in reverse. Or somebody's going to a high priestess to reverse your feelings about whoever it is you care for. It could be both. But that's what I'm picking up. Somebody's trying to plant a seed or trying to get you to have a child with them. Somebody could be like a farmer and maybe you're planting seeds or herbs or something like that. Third party healing. Come on now. You know who this person is. Don't act brand new. Masculine. I mean, you know, if you if you are a cultist or something, a, a reader, whoever this is, know who you is too. I, I know who you is too, but you know. We going we gonna to keep it in secret, like, like, like everything you do in secret, right? Keep that same energy. Um, keep that same energy. Don't, don't go try to pull no rabbits out your, out your arse now. Don't, don't do that. Because I'm going to go back. I'm going to go way, way back into them archives. Okay. And, and the people... That support me going to be like, we knew that already. Uh, queen of Pentacles. Queen, one time for the Queen of Pentacles. Something set, something set in stone. Somebody been sitting so long, waiting so long, they became bitter. For That's what they want. They want you to turn your back on this situation. Four of Coins. They want you to hold back from this, this situation. Somebody doesn't like the fact that you changed. Or you went through this change. Okay. You have, you, you design, you're like building on your own foundation. That's what this is. And this got somebody in regret. So this per Queen of Wands, this could be a masculine in their feminine energy. Because somebody's a shapeshifter alchemist here. Or this could be a family member of yours or theirs. Look, they're hiding. They're going to have Six of Swords energy. Hey, look. They're hiding. They're hi I'm, this is giving me in-laws. They're hiding from in-laws, people that they work with. Or maybe maybe this person was found out. This family, that's in reverse. This is a family. This is somebody that's been kicked out. Kicked out of the, the bloodline or divinity. If they have some royal gifts or some sort of affluence, they don't have it no more. They don't have it no more. Okay, I don't know if you walked away or this person walked away. 
Well, I know this Queen of Pentacles over here sitting there watching the sun <laughs> walk the way. They building on their own here. And that's why somebody's mad. We got the four of wands. Yeah. The four of wands to the five of wands. Because they was in competition. They was in competition. You know, they, they was watching you watch this walk this tightrope. And I said it earlier that they 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 did something. And then they 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 sat back, they watched, and they felt like whatever they were doing was working. But it, divine timing, baby. Somebody did something at the right time. Let me tell you, it hit different this time. Mm -hmm. It hit different this time. Yeah, yeah. You know why? Because all this ghost, shadow, moon, and and it's because somebody don't want something to ch to change. Like somebody's a energy harvesting somebody do some you know some nefarious things when it's nighttime or they do it in the shadow and then they come out like you know i'm they the best thing since sliced bread not a cups please this is somebody that's selfish greedy and they don't want to see nobody else get ahead okay look at that black widows memories this is something that happened in the past not somebody having a hard time trying to confront themselves. That's what this is giving. That's, a, that's what this is giving. Somebody could be going through old photos or they, you know, they're in that six of cups. I reminisce on the love we had. What kind of, and you, you a whole black widow out here? Are you attached to one? Somebody got bit, bit by a snake, by an insect. I think that came out. Oh, maybe you was camping or something. I'm here laid out in the sun. What is that about? We got silence. So somebody wasn't awake. Uh, they weren't woke. <laughs> they didn't want you to wake up to what was happening. <laughs> laid out in the sun. Come on, man. Laid out. In <laughs> they didn't want you to wake to their beast-like mentality. <laughs> Somebody's used to getting them coins, baby. Some, they got beside themselves. This is this is like something that totally did not have to happen. But because somebody's jealous and envious of other people's success, they feel like they could just, you know, play judge and jury. So you definitely had to go within. Whoever's in this hermit mode, you're gonna have you're gonna go into uh a place of solitude. I mean, you know, I don't I don't wanna say indefinitely, but that's what I feel like. If you if you new to this channel, that's what I that's what I see. Okay, because it's gonna stop an action because you gotta get centered. Okay, you gotta get centered, and you can't you can't be around these people for this action to stop. You can't. I'm here. You can't you can't share a breath with them. What does that mean? What is that? Somebody's about to go through ascension. Kundalini, Kundalini rising. Jacob's ladder could be significant. We're talking about a pineal gland activation for somebody here. The sign card, yeah. Connection to source. That's what I'm getting. Let's see. Um, why is this strength card here? Some of you, you may be thinking about this person. Maybe having a hard time. Somebody came in really quickly. You may have felt like they changed, but they left out just as quickly. Yeah, you know, with this new love and keep uh, and get out your comfort zone. You feel you feel you feel safe with this person because you got a past a history with them. You may feel like this is your divine counterpart. For some of you, you could have a marriage, children, or something. Something keeps you complacent where you feel comfortable. But somebody's attempting to keep you stuck. They, they know this about you, that you don't want to get to know someone else. And they play on that. Whether if you, maybe you're all right with that. Maybe you're okay with being a side piece or in a thropper or something like that. But that's not going to get you your ascension. It's like somebody's not stepping up to their calling with the ascendant here in the tree in reverse. Chariot, why is this here? Somebody knows that you don't want to have to go through the get to know someone else process but here's the thing you're not the only person you're supposed to be getting to know is yourself somebody's afraid to be by themselves 
You have to go through that to ascend. Somebody's worried about what other people think, maybe because they're getting a divorce or they may be a single parent or something like that. I feel like if that's the case, because somebody has a lot to say about other people when they see their hardship. And so they don't want to face themselves. They don't want to face the world. But there's an ascension coming. Because if somebody's trying to mask themselves, oh, this is about to be brought out. Somebody's going to have to get structured in this. Mm -hmm. They're going to have to. We got not today, love, and not an, I'm trying to tell you. Somebody came in and said, baby, baby, please get on your knees. And somebody said, okay. And when they finished, they took off. I feel like, look at that. I feel like I, I, I feel like I said that in the reading before. I feel like I did. Collective, didn't I say that in the reading? I know that this, this got to be a third party, a karmic, or distorted energy. I want to be nice. All right, I'm not even gonna get that ten of wands because this, no matter what it is, because I, I want to, but I'm not. Because look. I'm just going to say because and leave it alone. Child, uh, 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 I feel happy now. <laughs> I feel happy now. Look, some people be doing some, you know, deceptive stuff. I know a lot of people like to pull cards while um, I'm reading. Be mindful, though. Be mindful. Okay. Um, magician in reverse, child. Magician on the fence first, because this is a faded situation. So somebody took accountability, responsibility, and was able to move forward. They ended up with wish fulfillment because they moved away. They trusted their intuition. They're already in this energy of new beginnings. Okay, and now that's all I'm going to say. But whoever this is, that's on the opposite side, somebody that was willing to do anything to gain a victory, they call it some sort of illusion. We got we got smoke here and we got smoke there. Somebody's trying to cloak themselves, trying to act like they're innocent here. Look at that. Look at that. Somebody's going to gain, or you already did. This is about money. I hear victim blaming. Let's read it. To consider someone to be responsible for something wrong or unfortunate that has happened to find fault with someone. Outcome. You have earned the respect of the group. I know that's right. Caution. Proceed without doing too much action. Take charge. Listen. Somebody was exonerated here. And somebody like, I can't believe. I was going to say, I can't believe it's not but Look, 44 miracles. Somebody is sitting there like, how? Because <laughs> this person was paying attention to their environment. <laughs> That's how. You trying to send them turncoats in, them belly flops and woo wops. Wasn't nobody finna go for that? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Well, at least not the person I'm reading for, okay? All right, um... Okay, seven of wands. Why is this here on the fence? Come on, man. <laughs> All right, thank you kindly. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> A decline. <laughs> All right. So somebody should have said no. All the way to the up, to the bottom, to the middle, to the side. Cancer slide. No. That's what they should have did. Uh -huh. They got a special place in their heart for this one here. Yeah. They like, mm-mm, say it ain't so. This not my bonquisha. Bon this not my bonquisha. Oh, no, my bonquisha cannot. My baby mama, my spouse, oh, no, no way. Come, They didn't put the hee-hee-hee-hee-high on you a long time ago, bro. Sis? Mm-hmm. You know what they say, get down where you get mad at shit. Obviously, you didn't already did that. At least you attempted to. <sighs> mm, mm, mm. Yeah, I know. I'm, you know. 
Queen of Cups in reverse. Eat the show. That was quick. Oh, hides behind a look at the look at that. Hides behind a user name. Hides behind a costume. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> that costume is not hiding. <laughs> That's this person's demeanor. That's this person's demeanor. They always coming in with information and they going to someone to get this information. And this person is just, they pulling stuff out the sky. It's a whole illusionist. Everybody involved in this situation. <laughs> they said, oh, you got somebody coming new. Oh, you got a new opportunity. Let's bippity boppity boo. Let's the moon is, they was break dancing. And they was happy about it. Look, they was like, oh, they 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 believed it. They believed it. <sighs> Risk taker. <laughs> False hope. Turning tables on you. I'm trying to tell you. Look. Mm. Tree in reverse. Let's see what this look. Now you want to be like mine today? <laughs> God is within her or him. She or he will not fall. Yeah, with the with the strength of ten thousand armies, just the Armageddon. Hmm. Is it Armageddon? Somebody pregnant? Shall I did a reading? I re if I remember, if I don't share it in one of these information cards attached to this video, I'm gonna put it on the community board. Now, probably, a lot of people probably thought, like, you, you, you own one. When I said someone was doing spell work while pregnant and ended up giving birth to a DM's soulmate, a past life soulmate. Some of y'all like, nah, ain't no way. Um, okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm just leave it. I'm, I'm, I'm going to just leave it like that. You got nine of cups and insects, boy. You procreating. If you if you got some sort of spiritual gift, and you procreating with something that first and foremost, have you heard of the Nephilims? I suggest you <laughs> I suggest you research that. Cause if it, somebody's doing a lot of research, but often they're not doing the right research. This is it. They're, they're blocked off. They got brain fog, scattered brain, magician in reverse, fog here because they don't want to change. They, they don't want to go into solitude. They don't want to confront themselves. Yeah, and it's messing up their stability here. This is somebody that likes compassion. And they were doing this to someone that was compassionate. Maybe they felt like if they drained you, they can get more energy. That's what I feel like. Magician on the fence. Why is this here? That came out on the fence. Yeah, somebody have escaped escape it. Look. And the call part about it, for some of you, and this is triggering. This is this is about to be triggering what I'm finna say. Okay. For some of you, this person, you could have you have a, you could have a child that may have passed over. Okay. During like childbirth or immediately after, but this person, somebody trying to blame the passing of a child on someone else when it was on their own spell work backfiring. It was their own spell work backfiring. You see these two? We got, what's this, boss set? And I don't know what that lizard, maybe y'all know, maybe you could put it iguana or something. It could be a snake. I feel like it's Greek or Celtic. And I said that before. Um, I think it might mean like chaos. That's significant here. And so somebody has escapism issues. Look at that. But you had already moved forward. You had already been. So it's kind of like you... Being in your purpose, are you moving forward? That's usually how it happens. Revealed something that was done in the past. And somebody's possibly trying to figure out how you know they took this action. 
or how do you or how do you know or whoever this is know what was going to happen to them in the future? Okay, let me explain. Somebody knew could be me. Okay. That something was going to happen in the future to them and it came to pass, even though they felt like they were blocking it. But what they would do was actually manifesting it. Did you get what I'm saying? They thought that they were they thought they were a step ahead, but they were bringing it in to because they don't want to stop with the actions that they're taking. So it was definitely prophesized, but it was their own doing that brought this prophecy to light. Okay. Magician in reverse. Why is this here? Them and their entourage. Them and the copycat. The replica of the clone. <sighs> Come on, man. The queen of swords in reverse. Somebody was thinking, obviously. Learn from your experience. To re regain your peace and mind, peace of mind, exhausted and are feeling feeling overwhelmed. So somebody can't get out of their head. They're going to put them in the coffin. Come on now. We got nine of cups. I believe that's Pisces energy, but it don't necessarily have to be. And and there's another nine. So nines are significant. This is about the way somebody expresses themselves. If you're not a Pisces, a Scorpio, a Gemini, or any other sign, but I'm, I'm focused right here. This um, this is about your creativity, your growth. Uh, I believe is Sagittarius and I, I think so, to keep you from moving forward. Somebody was too much uh, in their pride. They they definitely went to something here to petition somebody ending something. Somebody wanted somebody to get bit by, by something poisonous. That's what I'm getting. Somebody wanted someone to get bit by something poisonous and it backfired on them or it's going to because somebody's going to use their intuition. I don't know if it's somebody going to be sitting under a tree. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> OK, so somebody deals with what is this? I heard spider. Do somebody think if they deal with tree in reverse, like somebody is disconnected from reality? Tree in reverse. A risk. The casino could be significant. Does somebody gamble off their inheritance at a casino? Oh. For some of you, this, this may be your father, but this could also be uh, a masculine. Look at this. Or your child's father. Ch I'm about to Woo. I heard um, when I said that, I heard um, two things. Is that uh, that with that song? I'm about I, I'm about to catch a case. I heard that. And then I heard you about to lose your job. That's what I heard. Child, I was about to remix it and put it together. And that's why I just stopped, surrendered to now. Surrender the drama, surrender to your soul's path, surrender the need to always be right. Look, somebody, I'm trying to tell you, somebody was trying to play judge and jury. This is someone that feels like they always right. And I believe it's because they do readings or they get readings. Listen, accept people and situations exactly as they are without denying the difficulties. And then you can see things clearly and make the best decisions. Look. This is a drama horror. They all about the drama, but they do it in secret. Let's see what's at the bottom. Surrender your fear. Of Surrender your ego. Oh, we now I feel like. Mm. So for somebody to ascend, they have to decline an offer. Or maybe they was offered something to decline you. So that they were blind. They were blindfolded. They were blindfolded. Ooh, wee. 
Nonetheless, this card's been coming out a lot lately. So somebody's a high vibrational. They think they mastered some sort of illusion. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. They think that they are master at what they do. But this was a calling. Like, if, if you notice, for the last couple of weeks, I've been putting out these readings talking about someone not realizing, right, somebody's purpose because they're so caught up in the mundane, in the money aspects that they keep the final destination. They're facilitating this change. All right. I'm tapping out. Deuces.